ladies and gentlemen, hello, welcome back to another Pillar Pilot video. Today I'll be walking through the model matchmaking I use for my flight simulation. There's a recent new one that's come to place and it's currently, I think, probably the best model matchmaking system available to us. So, let's dive straight into it. What we want to do first is you want to head to the IVAO website, which I put in the link in the description. You want to then scroll down till you find Altitude for Microsoft Flight Sim 2020. Hit here, hit download the voice current. It'll download a program, make sure you extract it and put that for, and make sure you then run it and it'll run a program and you need to download. It'll take approximately an hour from the servers as they are quite slow. You then want to make your way to the community folder and inside your community folder you want to scroll down once you've downloaded this thing after an hour and you want to make sure you've got the IVAO CXS file here. Inside this file will just be some objects. You can go in and have a look and you'll just see loads of aircraft in there for different aircraft. You've got A350s, A380s, 321s, 320s, 319s, loads and loads and loads of aircraft, 737s, it's just too many to name, but really, really good. So you need to make sure you've got that in your community folder. Once that's in your community folder, you can then head over to Model Matchmaking Magic. Once in Model Matchmaking Magic, you want to make you want to hit download. And once you've downloaded it, make sure you move it somewhere safe and extract the file that is. Once extracted, you'll be presented with this. And you want to run the Model Matching Magic application. Because we've just installed the IVAO stuff, if we head to Options, we want to make sure we tick Include IVAO Models. By including IVAO Models, we, can we know that it will use the models we already have. And it also seems to already recognize our community. If it doesn't recognize your community folder initially, what you want to do is head to your community folder and you want to copy this directory up here. Copy that directory and paste it into here. It should already do it as it does know where it is already, but if it doesn't, make sure you do find it and make sure you put it in there. So, what you then want to do is hit scan in the top right here. The program will freeze for a minute and go into not responding mode and you won't be able to click anything. Bear with it, it will quickly fix itself. See, it's gone not responding. I don't know what's going on down here. Get rid of this, go away. Right, once that's done that, we can see all these different aircraft. These are from my community and from the IVAO thing. So we now have thousands and thousands and thousands of aircraft. Make sure none are excluded. It does occasionally exclude some, and that is rather annoying. I don't understand quite why it excludes it. So just have a scroll through. If there's any ones you think, well, that shouldn't really be excused, should it? Uh, I don't know why it's excused. Um, you can de-tick them. But you just want to scroll through and make sure it's not excluding. It's excluding some, such as the Ferrari livery, because you wouldn't probably want that in your model matchmaking anyway. You wouldn't want an aircraft to be looking like that. So that's what it does. You then want to hit generate VMR file. Well, that does, it'll generate the VMR file, surprisingly, <laughs> um, into the file you extracted it from, which is here. It'll generate a model matchmaking file. So if we hit generate VMR file, so have generated. Here we go. Model matchmaking magic file appears here. We can now close this program or minimize it. Actually, don't close it. We got the model matchmaking magic here. We now want to move this to vpilot files. So if you just drag and drop into vpilot, you drag and drop it into v, your vpilot files, which will be wherever you left it. And it'll appear here as model matchmaking magic VMR file. You can then leave that. You can then um, close this. And you want to run vpilot as admin. vpilot run as administrator. Yes. And let it run. And there we go. Booted up vpilot. So, from here, we then want to go to settings. We want to go to model matchmaking. Custom rules. Make sure we click this little plus to open it up. Custom rules. Add custom rule set. Let's go to the vpilot files. And we'll see we've got a list of ones. I have a couple, a couple. But you want to click on your model matchmaking magic. Double click on it, it'll open it up, and it'll appear in here. You then want to hit apply, and OK. This has now been applied into your, um, into your vpilot files. You can then close this program with the red arrow here. You can just close it, and you want to then reboot it up if you're connecting to the network. If you're already connected to the network, all you need to do is type .aircraft into your chat box. If you spell it right, that might help. Dot aircraft into your chat box. 
and you'll see here we open up this and you just want to hit reload model matchmaking rules and that'll just reload it with your new model matchmaking system. That is how we download the model matchmaking magic files. Uh, I will put all links in the description if anyone in the comments knows anything else you need me to add. I'm happy to add, make another video of this. But for now, thanks very much for watching. That is how, very short video quickly there. I've wanted to get bosh this out, but that is how we make model matchmaking that works really, really well. So thank you very much. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.